Hello everybody and thanks for joining us for another Whitfield Food Review. Today we are trying Taco Bell's brand spanking new double things. German, what are they called? I don't know. Just new double things. Double stacks? They're essentially double decker tacos as they have a hard shell, soft shell, um, some sort of saucy, cheesy adhesive. One's cool habanero, one is sweet and spicy, and the other one is nacho crunch. Mm -hmm. Although I kind of think they got these maybe wrong. Wouldn't that be the nacho crunch? And I had a, I actually got a little bit of that sauce. It was hotter than shit, so I think that's the habanero. Oh. So this is going to be a little guessing game because they labeled them wrong. Funny is I heard about these over a year ago. We didn't think we'd be back necessarily for the new year. We certainly didn't think we'd be back for the holidays, but when Taco Bell puts something new out... You gotta do it. Our tacos and braces do not mix well, so she's gonna barely be able to eat any of these, but don't worry, we got a whole bag of goodies. They said this was nacho crunch, but I, I don't believe them because that one has crunchy stuff in it. Because I'm smart, I'm like Sherlock, I figured it out. So, bottoms up. It's hot. Ooh, there's a sweetness up. Damn, it's pretty hot actually. Woo! Oh, there is like a sweet chili sauce on there. Yeah, that's a sweet and spicy okay, one. Okay, so this is, a, this is a little game. Taco Bell made us do a little game. We didn't even know. I believe this is the sweet and spicy one, actually. Yeah. Because there's very clearly a sweet chili sauce on there. See right there? It is kind of a habanero heat where it just encompasses your mouth and the back of your throat a little bit. But then you get that nice little sweet kick and it offsets it a little bit. But it's still stinging, but it's not in a bad way. And I can tell you right now, I've never had a sweet chili sauce from Taco Bell ever. Well, this is this one's got to be the habanero because that one's got chips in it. Wouldn't that be nacho crunch? Nacho crunch. Uh, we believe this is a habanero. Bottoms up. Mmm. Mmm. Right. That sauce is really smoky and good. Mmm. No is... heat. I swear to God, I think they mix these up. But yeah, this... I finally put the habanero stuff on here and it should be on there. Is that what is that then? It's supposed to be habanero. That's ranch. So, okay, I'm almost positive because what? see how they do it is they have the sauce in between the two. I'm positive they put habanero on the sweet chili sauce in here and put it in the nacho crunch wrapper. Yeah, I'll eat, I'll eat the crunch for both of us. I don't need sauce. Man, I didn't put no sauce on that one. It just tastes like a taco. Mm-hmm. That's just nacho crunch. What are you gonna do? They put enough with the nacho cheese on the inside, I guess. Okay. So I must let's just assume they did this right. I don't think they did. You stuff you You didn't catch. It's still there. I'm gonna assume these are right, even though I don't think they are. Um this is the sweet chili, this is the habanero, and this is the nacho crunch. That's for sure. I don't. I think they might have mixed and matched their sauces a little bit, but first of all, these are a dollar each, which I think is a steal because double decker tacos have been one of my favorite things since they implemented them like in the '90s. By far, the least flavorful was the uh, nacho crunch one, mainly because it was a little dry. Yeah, they didn't put enough sauce on it. And when it's dry, the last thing you want is extra crunch. So it's just like like a like a box of stale Wheaties. Definitely did not have the same, whoa, factors these two. For me, it would be the habanero one. And the reason why is because that one's second is because it's just ranch. Mm -hmm. Now, if there w was heat in that, like this heat with that, like I literally want to just swap these out and try it, but I'm not going to. I think the combination of the heat and the, because it's supposed to be cool habanero. That makes more sense to have the heat from the habanero with ranch. That'd be amazing. As it is, it was still very tasty. We might have got some weird amalgam that wasn't supposed to exist of the habanero sweet. Well, isn't it supposed to be sweet and spicy though? I'm out of that. I don't know what's going on. I'm lost. To be honest with you, this one was awesome. The sweet and spicy one tastes like nothing Taco Bell's ever had. The idea of a ranch double decker sounds good to you. Get that, get the habanero cool. But if you want something completely different than anything Taco Bell's ever had, that sweet and spicy sauce, never had anything like that from there. What do you think? Yeah. There you I go. I agree. I'm going to say this is a 2 out of 5. This is a th 3 out of 5. And this is a 4.5 out of 5. I just made that up. I think that's 4. Do you? Not 4.5. Okay. I think that sauce is really good on there. I th I 
I think it would have been better with the heat, but. Okay, so she says four to 4.5, ow. And I'm drinking Kickstart, so I'm all jacked up. Mountain Dew. That's what we think. These are a dollar each. I don't think you can go wrong with that. I'm mean, three bucks. You, this is a lot of food and you get a lot of variety. So either way, hope you all have a wonderful holiday and a happy new year and all that stuff. Who knows, you might see us before then anyway. I don't know. Thank you for watching. Please like, favorite, subscribe, hit that notification button so you know when we do stuff. Otherwise, you won't know we do stuff. And even if you do it, you might not know we do stuff.